Here we go. Look at this. This is the view from the summit of Mount Everest. It's an interactive panorama. And if we click on one of the green labelled peaks, it takes you to the next panorama. Um, I thought I'd give you a quick tour of the Kumbu. It was a bitterly cold day on Amadablam. This is uh, the summit shot we got from there. And if I scroll all the way around to Tengbushe, we've got various other green labels down here, but if we go to Tengbushe, you get a great view up and down the Kumbu. So we've got Amadablam, we've got Everest and Lotse. Uh, you've got the Pangbushe village. There's one outside the monastery in Upper Pangbushe. We've got one on the trail there. We've got over at Tashi's place. Um, at Kanjima, we've got the village down here of Tengbushe where the monastery is, and just here we can peek at Gokyo Ri. Uh, this was another cold one actually. The lake would normally be bright blue, but um, it was all frozen over. It was the beginning of April. And look at this, we could go westwards to the Renjo La. Now, the view from the Renjo La is one of the most impressive vistas in the Kumbu. So um, if ever you go trekking, do head west of Napsha Bazaar, go to Tame, up the Tame Valley and over the Renjo La, and this is the view, all being well, that you will be presented with. Um, we've got the South Col. Managed to get two panoramas up at the South Col, one on the mound above the South Col, and the other one uh, just away from the camp here. And if I zoom in, Let's have a look. There is a bird in the... Oh, there we go. There's a bird flying above the South Col. Lots of people waiting for their summit bid. Lots of tents, everyone getting ready and uh, brewing up and resting up, ready for setting off into the night. And they're going to be going up these slopes here to the balcony. You can see the trail there in the middle of the screen and hopefully folk are going to get to the summit of Mount Everest and this will be the view that they hopefully get. So there you go, it's an interactive panorama. Have a look around either from this um, photo or you can go to this website up here, mountainpanoramas.com and there's loads of footage, either from the Alps and South America, and uh, obviously all the stuff that I've been doing in conjunction with Thomas Werbs um, from Nepal. I hope you enjoy it.